Okay, welcome back to Maximizing Information Resources for Profit. And in this video, we're going to talk about how you actually get your resources into the hands of others. You're probably asking now, <coughs> all of these strategies are great, but if I can't actually get them into the hands of other people, then these strategies aren't going to help me very much. And you'd be absolutely right. So we're going to talk about some ways that you can actually get your resources into people's hands. Now one of the things that you can do is pay-per-click marketing and you'll need to make sure that you can create an effective headline that will attract the attention of your particular target market and the more that you know about your target market and that's going to be the case with any of these methods the more that you know about them and where they hang out and what they respond to the better you're going to be at getting their attention to want your resource you're going to have to get their attention first and pay-per-click marketing is a very good way if you understand well enough how to write the headlines that get them to look to get their attention of course one of the best ways that you can do this is by working within your social networking context now the the there is a caution that I would give you here social networking can be very time-consuming and you'll need to come up with a method and you'll need to come up with a time limit even if you decide that you want to have someone else work on this uh, you can you you can lose a lot of time with this indirect marketing method and not see profit what you must do with social networking is you must get your you must understand what your process is to getting your social network following to both share your information as well as to find it attractive enough to start looking at it in the first place so in a lot of cases you will want to use social networking to meet new people and the best way to do that is to create shareable content and to have your following to share that content with other people of course you'll be wanting to use content marketing and much of that has to do with blogging and article directories and even in some cases you'll want to do video marketing and audio marketing and podcasting you know again what you're doing is you are putting yourself in a position to be found by people who have the problem that your particular product or service solves and definitely your information now we've talked about blogging before and we talked even about blogging here you will want to make sure that the key to your blogging is developing that dialogue with the with your target market and you'll want to advertise every place that you possibly can within your budget now if you're going to advertise you're going to want to make sure that you have tracking mechanisms in place so that you'll know what your most effective advertising uh, placement is and that you can then start to move uh, your your promotion to the most effective place that is how you'll get the most of your advertising dollar but it is another way to get your free information into the hands of other people and of course you'll want to make sure you if you have a list and I know that some of you will be using your free information to build your list and I understand that but as you build your list you want to continue to send that free information especially shareable information so that people will feel inclined to let their friends see it and say things like doesn't this make you angry or wow this is really incredible or did you know this was happening you want to have people saying that about your content and you can do that by sending it out to your email list and by making sure that you have people who are loyal in terms of uh, wanting to send and submit and syndicate, syndicate your information so with that thanks and I will see you in the next video